Hey guys, what's up? So today I'm going to show you on how to mine ADA. And at this current point in time, ADA has been very slow, to say the least. The rest of the market has been going, but ADA has been pretty stagnant. But today it's made a pretty good move. And now you're wondering, is it a good time to mine ADA? And the answer to that is a big, definite yes. It's a very good time to mine ADA. It's always a good time to mine ADA because ADA will go over time much higher. Now, in this video, I'm going to show you how to mine ADA and where you can get staking on it. Now, this is always the boring part. Let me show you how to set it up because everybody's going to run into problems straight away. If you're familiar with my videos, I always do this because people always still get these questions. So let's go. Right click on your main screen, make a little folder and just give the name. Miner Booyah, then go to your Windows settings, go to Update and Security, Windows Security Settings, Virus and Threat Protections, Manage Settings, and Add or Remove a Exclusion. And select Folder, and make sure you select the folder that you just created. Now, it's going to give you a little message. Once you have done that, you can go to Google and type in a mineable. Right click on it, go to the website, go to downloads. But first you have to disable the security for a little second, else Windows is gonna flag it as a um, virus or whatever. But I've scanned the folder and it's safe. So you wanna go to and it's set to Dutch, I'm sorry. Privacy and security, go to security, go to uh, disable um, security. And then once you have done that, you can right click on the download link and save it directly into your folder. If you don't do it like this, the file is gonna be removed or Windows is gonna flag it and you're gonna run into problems. Now, once you have done all of that and you've installed Unminable, you can open it and you're going to get this screen. Now, you have to select either a GPU or CPU. GPU is for people who have like gaming PCs or high-end PCs. And CPU is for people like who have school PCs without any dedicated graphics cards. GPU mining is faster than CPU mining. So over here, I'm going to select uh, GPU mining. And in this list, you can type all kinds of crypto but today we're covering, let's call it Cardano, not Cordano. Now, the next thing you want to do is, is install any wallet. Personally, I like using Atomic Wallet. It's just a very nice wallet. Offers a wide variety of coins. Um, so over here, I'm using Atomic Wallet. You might use Binance or, or Coinbase, whatever. Those all work. What you want to do is you want to search for Cardano and then search for your receive address. Copy the address and paste it into this little bar. Now, the next thing you want to do is, is you want to set a referral code. I would like it if you use my code, but you could also use your friend's code. It's whatever you like. Uh, it reduces the fees and it just it's beneficial for both people. Now, once you have set all of this up, you can start mining. Um, you can just start it like this. First thing I usually do is I press on the advanced settings. I Select either low or high. It depends on if you want to get work done on your PC or not. Um, then set your mining algorithm. It's either ETC hash or ET hash or Ethereum Classic hash or Ethereum hash. Um, it depends on much how much VRAM your uh, GPU has. So you want to select um, ETC or Ethereum Classic hash with three gigabytes of VRAM. And if you have more than four gigabytes of VRAM, select Ethereum hash. Now you can name your PC, you can also set your referral code and you can start uh, the mining app on startup. Now, the next thing you can do is, is you can calculate your profits. How you do that is, is you wait a little while to see how much hash rate you have. Then you're gonna find Cardano. Hello, it's probably at the top. Cardano and then type in how much hash rate you have and you get an uh, estimate of how much um, you will be making a day. 
Now over here, you can see your balance, you can refresh it. You can also see the, uh, the payout. If you have enough, you can set it to a auto payout or you can just manually pay out every single day. So now we're gonna calculate the profits. Let me show you on how to do that. So we just use the tool I just showed you. Um, so for me, just let's just make it easy. This is how much ADA I would get a month, should I mine 24 seven times the price. Let's get the point. So I would get 432 points. $81 a month. That's pretty freaking high, isn't it? But you know what? This can two a three X. <laughs> it's not a joke. Mining is really beneficial. Now to all you warriors out there who are like, Daryl, you can't mine ADA. You're right, you can't mine ADA. But what, you, what you're doing is, is you are either mining uh, Ethereum or Bitcoin and it's conveniently being converted to ADA. Now, if you're wondering what is the best time to mine ADA, it's when the price is low. Is it still worth it? Yes, because the price might be high in the day, but in general, it's pretty low. So it's a good time to mine ADA. I'm mining it currently. I sometimes switch between Solana, Mining, Polygon, Shiba, it just depends on what the prices are and which one gives me the most revenue. Um, but it's all dependent on gear. If you have a very good PC with a 3090 or 3080 or 3080 Ti, you will get crazy amounts of, of uh, crypto or you know Cardano. Um, but if you're using a little bit slower uh, system, that's also fine. You might make a little bit less, but it's definitely worth it. Let's say you make a fourth of this, right? Which might be nice. You will, you will make a good $100 a month. Still, if the price would 3X, you're still getting $300. Hence the thumbnail. Now, if that's worth it to you, that's up to you, but I know what I'm doing. Now, if you're wondering about the staking part, if you look at your atomic wallet, there's a little tag over here called staking. And by just depositing or mining your Cardano to the wallet, you're getting staking, 5% yearly yield. It doesn't freeze like many other coins do, so really easy. And guys, just be patient, hold it, huddle, don't sell it. I'm not a financial advisor, don't buy or sell anything of what I say or do, but holding crypto does not harm you. You will get staking, prices usually go up, hold it for a couple of years and you will be very happy with the little crypto you think you've mined today. Now what, that was it, what I have for you guys today. Hit the like and subscribe button if this was any useful and I'll catch you next time guys, peace.